G'day Adam Makers, this is Nat with another video tutorial. This tutorial is about Oxygen 2. Oxygen 2 is one of the main tools used for uh, modding in Armour 2. Now, the first uh, thing you're probably going to have to do is, after you've installed the tools, see previous tutorial video, you're going to have to uh, set up a profile for Bulldozer. Bulldozer is the uh, main tool used to preview your stuff. Now, to do that, the easiest way is, uh, by the way, the restart is so that you can get P drive. P drive is the mirror drive of your main archive address. As you'll see, P here is the same as Armour 2 work. Same drive. But uh, the tools require uh, P to be set up. Now, to set up this bulldozer profile that I was talking about, um, best or easiest way to do that is to go to your Armour 2 directory, basically the game directory, not the tools directory, and uh, you'll find a uh, armour2.cfg file there. Copy it. Take a copy of it. Go to your work directory. Paste a copy of it. Now, when you uh, open it up, you'll notice it is basically a um, your game config startup. But uh, for the preview window in Bulldozer, you don't want it so big. Recommend that you change the size to something like uh, 1344 by 840 which is approximately 80% uh, of the size of your uh, normal file. Okay, save that, and we go back to it. Recommend you change this config file to something like armor 2 bulldozer.cfg. There you have that file. Now we'll go ahead and open up uh, Oxygen 2. If you've installed it, be under Start, All Programs, Bohemia Interactive, Tools, Oxygen 2, Personal Edition, started. Now, depending on uh, whether you install the first lot of tools, depends on how this appears when you first start it. If you've had some uh, previous config arrangements basically uh, preferences set up for the previous Oxygen version, then your screen may appear first time differently to this. But you will we'll note that up the top here it's got Oxygen 2 PE for Armour 2, so it's definitely the new version of the tool. Okay, before we go trying to start the Bulldozer Preview window, which forms part of the uh, Oxygen tool, we're going to change the config. Go to File Options. Now, you get a dialog box here for all your options. But you will note that uh, one of the first options is the External Viewer. Click on that, go down to the bottom, and basically this is how it should start when you've uh, installed the tools. If it doesn't look like that after you've installed the tools, it might be because you didn't have the first lot of the tools installed. Either way, it should be uh, in quotes p colon slash bulldozer exe windows or dash windows dash bulldozer dash no land then add dash cfg equals p colon slash armor to bulldozer dot cfg. That's that file you just made. Just go OK there. Most of the um, other settings in this um, config should be OK. One of the ones that you might want to change uh, is probably the uh, right at the very bottom. Auto convert GIFT and TGA textures, uh, which is uh, one of the features part of the tools. OK, now that we've done that, we'll go back and uh, Make sure the viewer is working, basically to our preferences. Go to Viewer, Viewers, Bulldozer, Start or Restart. 
it should uh, turn away for a little bit with this little box here and then you actually get the preview right let's just see if it works you will notice that we haven't got a mouse cursor don't know whether that's a uh, um, specific to uh, different operating systems in Windows whether that's a problem especially because it's windowed but anyway the easiest way to move away from the preview screen is to hold down alt and press tab and go to the oxygen 2 um, icon on the list okay you're back to oxygen now let's see if it's working we'll do the simplest trick of all we'll, we'll create a box Go to create box, one meter by one meter box, right there in the center. Just for a bit of an effect, we're going to highlight the whole box, and that's simply click outside of the area in question, drag over the top, so it's all highlighted. And we're going to sharpen the corners of all the edges. So you go surfaces, sharp edge. Okay, let's go back to our preview. Now the easiest way to do that is either select it on the taskbar or just Alt-Tab again. Alt-Tabbed, there's our preview. Now, it doesn't look like much there at the moment, but the preview is done, basically manipulated by basically using the mouse. Holding down the uh, right key and moving the mouse about changes the... Uh, angle at which you're looking at the object. Holding down the left mouse key and moving about changes where it's at and where you're going to. So lift the mouse key if you want to uh, take a better shot at it. Here I'm using the right mouse key again to rotate it around. Okay, looks like the uh, bulldozer preview is working. Okay, now that we've done that, I'm going to do a little bit more here on the uh, layout of uh, O2. But first of all, I'm going to get rid of this project and just load you one of the sample models BIS provided from the original Armour 1. Get rid of this one by saying, no, I don't want to save it. I'm going to open up a uh, previous model. This model, let's open up the truck, shall we? Okay. Here's a view of the truck. Now, when you first came into Armour, oh, sorry, Oxygen 2, you might have been a few uh, of these taskbar out of uh, place. For example, you may have found something like that. Easy enough to move around. Click on the end of it, move it, and drop. You may have also found different windows visible. They're fairly easy to select. Um, this four window view is under Windows four view. Below it, you will see a whole bunch of uh, other views basically ticked. Now, these are the the ones you see on the left and the right hand side are basically these ones that are ticked. You can add them or remove them simply by clicking and unclicking. That one, for example, was a measurement. It now appears over here. You can move it about like most of the things on the screen by again going up to the edge, clicking it, dragging it, and dropping it, and it'll stay there. When you restart Oxygen 2, it should be in exactly the same position.